Last night I had every intention in the world on coming out here and checking on her through the night, but we got really sick. So, just woke up and there's two dry babies in there with mama. I'm gonna go in and check them out, make sure they're good. Make sure they're nursed. All right, I scooped them out and put them down here in the sun so they could continue drying. It looks like mama hurt her foot. I've looked and I don't see anything, but she won't st step down on it. So she followed us easily though. We got two little bucklings. Yay. <laughs> oh. Aww. Mama, you're a good mama. I'm gonna wait here and see if, whoops. I'm gonna wait here and see if they are definitely getting a chance to nurse. Looks like they know what they're doing, so I think they have, yeah. Oh yeah, he knows what's going on. Are you gonna get in there too? Both their bellies feel nice and round, but I do like to witness it with my own eyes to be sure sucks being sick but this happening so I usually like to spend more time with them and visit I'm just gonna go grab the iodine for the cords and the molasses water for mama and then I'm going back into rest we really got hit with a yucky but it's spring <laughs> Babies are being born. The incubator is chirping like crazy. We have nine new chicks this morning that weren't there last night. Two new baby goats that weren't there last night. So it's a good day, even if we're not feeling our best. Hey. Welcome to the world, cutie pies. Aww. Oh man, you like those little fluff nuggets? Yeah. Cleo likes them too. You always have to be careful if you have a cat in the house. We are closely watching these guys. These are the first nine that hatched. They were fluffy and causing a little bit of rambunctious issues. So I very carefully and quickly opened the incubator not to release any humidity so that the rest will be able to hatch just fine. <laughs> They're sweet. Level one achievement reached. Grown-up kitty allows new kitten to eat with her. Yes, very good. Oh boy, we have one hatching right now. This is actually the one that I marked that might need assistance. When I checked on it earlier today, it did appear to... Oh, there it goes! Oh, it did it on its own! It was facing the wrong direction, so I did turn it. And I'm gonna go ahead and take these fluffy ones out to go in the brooder now. Mm. They are so cute. Got about 20 chicks now. Got, I think there's 18 in here right now, two in the incubator. A few more pipping still. So, 20 and counting. You love the babies, don't you? This is the first time Odin's really been old enough to pay attention to chicks. And it reminds me so much of Rowan and Liam at this age. <laughs> being fascinated by raising chicks. Yeah. You like them? Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. And your big brother likes them too. Rowan's still fascinated by chicks. <laughs> I think we all are.
baby. I still don't know why mama is limping. I have no sign of any heat or anything. Nothing in her hoof. So I'm hoping she gets well soon. But she's doing a really good job of taking care of the babies. So that's good. The little buckling Chewy went to his new home and I think the lambs miss him. But he got a great new home. He's going to be part of an ag program for schools, which makes us super happy. And his brother that Robert took has actually gone to join him too. So the two little bucklings have been reunited at a new farm. Super excited about that. The babies are doing wonderful. They are so cute. Mama's done a great job taking care of them. She got plenty of milk. Hi, babies. They're so pretty. Pretty like their mama. Good job, girl. Good job. Yes, you love that. You love to be praised. <laughs> Dump the water out and put your water lid on your head. You are such weird little piggies. Weird little piggies you are. And you're sleeping. Even though I just walked up on you. Silly piggies. I wonder if Peaches will mind if I try feeling her belly. She's a pretty friendly girl. She likes to be pretty. Not in the mood? What's the matter, baby? Oh. Yeah. Are you not in the mood to be padded right now? You just want to enjoy your son? You used to like belly rubs. Maybe it's because you are pregnant, huh? Yeah. I'm thinking she's probably going to be more in the May due date than the April due date. Yeah. Girl. Yeah. She don't look that big. So crossing my fingers she is actually bred. What do you do, Bowser? Huh? What do you do, Bowser? <laughs> Bowser's a boy. He not do. He get fat. We're gonna have to be careful. He's getting too much feed, I think. So while I've been busy in the garden, Ryan has been busy over here getting our new aviary coop ready. We will be showing it to you shortly. I'm really excited. We have it set up pretty good for the run, but now we have to change gears into the garden. So we're setting up a temporary area for them to sleep in so that we can at least get the chickens out of the yard. So there will be more added to this, but it will be later when we're able to get more resources to build the rest of it. But overall, spring is here, and it's been another wonderful day on the homestead. <laughs>